What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to today's video. If you are new here, do not forget to subscribe and hit that bell notification so you never miss a future upload. Today's video is going to be a Fashion Nova Curve try on haul. Obsessed with Fashion Nova. I've worked with them many times in the past and I am collaborating with them again in this video. They sent some pieces over and I wanted to show you guys what they look like, how they fit, quality, all that jazz. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So the very first item that I picked out is so freaking beautiful. I kept in mind that I'm trying to find a dress for engagement photo shoots and this is definitely a contender. It is this emerald green velvet long slinky dress that is freaking to die for. It has this really deep V in the front in the back, it's a pretty low V as well. It hugs my curves, but also kind of flows a little bit at the bottom. I just think it's absolutely beautiful. It is long sleeve like I wanted. We are taking engagement photos, I wanna say in October, so it will definitely be a little bit more chilly. And this is kind of what I was going for. Originally I was thinking I wanted emerald green, but a little bit more flowy, and this is definitely like hugging the curve so I'm not sure yet but it's definitely like I said a contender and I just cannot wait to rock this and see how it looks in photos. Um, this I got in a 2x and the material is just like this thick like stretchy velvet which is nice and it does have um, wiring here in the boob area so that way the V kind of like sits up on your boobs and is not like super slouchy. I just think it's perfect, it's perfection, and I love it. The next item that I picked is a wild one. It is a two-piece set, and it is all leopard. So I got the leopard leggings. Both of these pieces, by the way, are in a 2X. So the leopard leggings, and I like how they um, kind of flow out a little bit at the bottom. If you guys have watched TikTok, and like the TikTok videos where the girls are like roller skating, this gives me that vibe, and I don't know why. I think it's like the the pant legs. They're almost like bell bottomy, but they're so freaking cute. Uh, very, very stretchy material. This is, like I said, the bottoms. And then the top is this like ruched, the very stretchy elastic off the shoulder top. Such a freaking cute set. I actually posted a picture of myself wearing this on my Instagram, so if you're not following me, I will leave the link down below. Definitely go follow me on Instagram. Then I picked up this yellow, like almost satin material top. This is what it looks like here. It has buttons going up the front, a little ruffle detail here at the bottom, and these really nice, like poofy, billowy sleeves. I like the length of these sleeves a lot. It's just a little bit different. Uh, it's not a short sleeve, it's not a long sleeve. It's really not even like a three quarter length. It's like just right above the elbow. I really like that a lot. This is not a stretchy material at all and I got it in a 2X. It fit perfectly, but it's a little bit hard, honestly, to get back off, like trying to get it up over the boobs. So just keep that in mind, but it does fit perfectly. Um, for reference, I am 5'7" and I'm a size 18, so, so freaking cute. Then I picked up this like chiffon material top. I just thought it was cute, something different. I don't really have anything like this. It is a long sleeve, it has buttons at the wrist. Um, it is completely button up. In the try on portion, I showed you what it looked like just like this, and then I showed you what it looked like when I tied it up more as like a cropped top. But I just thought the print was cute, just something different like I said. Um, I probably wouldn't have worn it with the jeans that I did in the try-on. I pair everything, honestly, with black skinny jeans. That's just the way I roll. So I'd probably <laughs> pair it with some black uh, jeans or black shorts, but I just thought it was really cute. I got this in a 2X as well, and it is not a stretchy material. Then I picked up this like just basic black top. It does have buttons going up the front, and kind of um, it's kind of almost peplum style. It, the buttons up the front, by the way, are like fake buttons. They're kind of just sewn on, so they're not useful whatsoever. The back of the top has this crisscross action, as well as some stretch detailing, if you can see that. I picked this top up in a 2X, and it is made of stretchy material due to that back part. I thought it fit perfectly. The um, arm sleeves are really, really flowy, so if you're not a fan of that, this probably is not the shirt for you, but 
Um, maybe if you're somebody who has bigger arms, it would be absolutely perfect. If that's like an area of concern where you get tops and they fit but the arms don't, this would definitely be one where they would. So I really like this as well. Then I picked up a pair of like oversized mom jeans. They're definitely a little roomier than your typical jean. Um, it is this light wash and it has distressing and like a ripped knee. And then I rolled mine at the bottom so it's kind of compre length. Um, I really like them, they're super stretchy. I got mine in a 2X and I feel like it was almost a little bit too big, especially in the waist. So I'm gonna have to wear a belt for sure, but I feel like I should have sized down to a 1X. So yeah, I really, really like these a lot and I get a lot of use out of uh, pants that are not black, especially in the summer. So then I thought I would branch out and get a pair of shorts, but I got these in a 2X and they're way too small, like they won't even go on. They are a little bit longer than, say, your typical short. I thought they were so cute the way they were ripped up, but I didn't realize either that the back was, like, super ripped up. Like, I feel like your butt will definitely be showing in these. Um, if, I, if they fit, I would have tried them on for you. These are a 2X. Yes, a 2X. And they're definitely too small, but they're super cute. So with all of this quarantine stuff going on, I'm really not going anywhere. So I picked up another two-piece set, but it's loungewear. And this is a gray tie-dye pair of like super stretchy uh, bottoms. They're almost like just a thin like legging material. Very cute. And then the matching top. This is meant to be more of like an oversized top. I got this set in a 2X and very comfortable and I'm definitely gonna be rocking this around the house a lot. I am right now teaching from home. I'm teaching summer school, so everything is via Zoom. And it's like, I wanna be comfortable, but I also wanna still look put together. So half the time I'm wearing like really cozy bottoms and then like a nicer top. But I feel like this just looks like almost like a tie dye or like acid wash top. It's not like, oh yeah, you're wearing pajamas for sure. Not that at all. So I feel like I could get away with this, but that's the reason why I really like that. Then in preparation for going back to school and out into the real world, because California just passed that you have to wear a face mask out in public, I picked up two face masks. One of them is just all black, plain old black. And then the other one is a leopard one. I thought they were really cute. Fashion Nova has some cute face masks on their website and they're only like $5, so you can't beat it. I also picked up, I don't know where it went, honestly, I think it's in my car, but I picked up another face mask that's almost, that almost looks like this. It's like a gray and black like acid wash. Um, print I guess and it's shaped like this one. I like this one a lot because it's super oversized like It's damn near covering my eyes like I don't know I like it So that was it for this Fashion Nova haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it I have a lot more hauls coming up so I really hope you guys are digging these videos. If you have any questions or comments, definitely leave them down in the comment section. I will have all of these items listed in the description box, as well as my height and what size I wear, just in case you forget. Um, just kind of a place where you can like go back to reference what I talked about during this video. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.